plenty more to come, I think, if they're going to live in Canada. Let's uh, catch up with the weather prospects back here right now. Susan Powell has those. Hello. Afternoon, Jane. If only our weather brought all so much joy to all of us but actually today with clear blue skies on offer across much of the UK now uh, this afternoon's picture is going to be pretty pleasant if you want to head out and about and catch some of the leftovers of the autumn colours before those final leaves get blown away. Here we are today in a little gap between weather systems a little ridge of high pressure yesterday's showers now over across Scandinavia tomorrow's wet and windy weather waiting in the wings for the northwest for the rest of this afternoon, a relatively light breeze, a lot of dry weather and some sunshine. Maybe just a few stray showers remaining around the Bristol Channel area and pushing into Wales. Another mild afternoon as well, highs of 13 to 15 degrees. Cloud just drifting into the west, turning the sunshine a little bit hazy by the end of the afternoon. But it won't be really until the evening that we start to see any rain pushing into Northern Ireland. Some wetter weather late evening, early hours of Wednesday for Wales, pushing across Northern England as well, where it could turn out to be quite heavy. And also some much wetter weather for Southern and Eastern Scotland by the end of the night. A few sheltered spots in the northeast getting a little chilly through the small hours. Generally, though, we have a mild night in prospect. For Wednesday daytime, a lot of sunshine, even first thing across central and eastern counties of England, and then that brighter, clearer weather will push its way further north as the day goes on. So by the afternoon, even after a wet start, some cloud will linger across Northern Ireland and Northern England, but a much drier picture here. Dry for much of Scotland come the afternoon too, and warm as well, temperatures 15, 16 degrees, even where we still have some cloud. Now we're going to keep the mild weather through the end of the week. It's also though going to settle down somewhat more so we'll tend to lose the showers and perhaps see more in the way of lingering cloud and a few stubborn patches of fog. One more weather system just to glance through to the northwest on Thursday and then high pressure surges across from the continent and it looks like it's going to be pretty keen to stay with us even on into next week. Here's Thursday though, just that weather system there, as I said, just glancing into the northwest, bringing some rain to Northern Ireland and Western Scotland. That could be the last of any significant rainfall though we see for at least a week or so. Further south, some lingering clouds, some mist and fog across central parts of England, but in the sunshine up to 17 in London, positively spring-like, never mind the end of autumn. And then we look further ahead, and remember that area of high pressure building across us, that is going to bring a lot of dry weather. Mild on Friday, temperatures just starting to eke down a little bit though through the weekend as that cloud gets ever more stubborn.